Kids and parents fill this room every week to listen to Miss Rebecca's story time. They range in age from two to five. Miss Rebecca has done these story times for four years now and says she's overwhelmed by all the love and support she's getting. I really appreciate that they love me. That's, that's really nice. Everybody's nice. <laughs> Parents love her story time because it's an interactive mix of music, dancing, and learning. She's just so engaging. She's just, her personality is just absolutely perfect for this. When parents heard that Miss Rebecca might be replaced, they started a petition to keep her in her story time. Amanda Cook attends the story with her daughter and started the petition. The response from the parents has been overwhelming. Um, I think we have like 300 people who signed the petition. So many parents just want Miss Rebecca to keep doing story time. Parents love Miss Rebecca and her story time so much, they even made these stickers to show their support. The library knows how good Miss Rebecca is too. It plans to expand its children's services and build new partnerships and story hours. The library director thinks Miss Rebecca is perfect for the job. I think she'll do a wonderful job taking the message out into the community. Um, and I'm sorry there have been hard feelings created because she's a wonderful addition to our staff. Miss Rebecca couldn't comment on her situation, but says she loves doing what she does. Many parents say they love her too, and they don't want anything to change. Pauline Villanueva, Grady News.